So it's a little afternoon, about minus 10 degrees, and I'm just working on the trailer again. Started ripping up the subfloor, which is being a bit of a pain in the ass, but it's coming. Uh, let's head in and have a look. <clears throat> I started at the rear end here, and uh, it definitely needed to come up because the undercarriage is completely rotted away and it's letting water up and then the insulation is <coughs> totally soaked and lots of mice and stuff in it so it's rotted, the frame is rotted pretty bad along the outside in some spots and especially in the corners uh, so it's a bit of a job to try to keep the framing intact as possible without uh, yeah, damaging it as as I rip up the plywood here, but it's coming, and I'm I'm I think I'm gonna redo all the framing. It's pretty patchwork, and uh, the insulation needs to be done. All the steel needs to be done, so I'll probably <clears throat> rip it all out. But I don't want the walls to collapse down on me either. So, and I'm just being careful to avoid the uh, light. <clears throat> the trailer lighting wiring here as I rip it up because I don't want to do that Again, and it does work, but I think I did hit my brake line here <clears throat> So I'll have to fix that But uh, yeah, it's actually kind of nice. That it's uh, Cool out because I can just wail away at it with the trusty old pickaxe and um, the insulation is largely waterlogged and soaked, so it's not too dusty in here either, so. Yeah, <clears throat> the only thing is everything's frozen, so the uh, plywood chips, chips up pretty good, but, yeah. <clears throat>